Greeting! My name's Joe Bob, and I'm very peeved. And welcome back to Deus Ex. So I have paused because otherwise, Anna Navarro over there would rudely interrupt my intro. So yeah, we've finished up the uh, introductory mission already. We've fought some terrorists, saved the day, and discovered some very completely non-disturbing things about UNATCO and the world as a whole. Because we are the good guys, remember. And now we're gonna go fight some more terrorists, or hold up in some power plant, with the aid of this bozo. Yo. Alright, let's go. The terrorists are in a fighting retreat. A few have barricaded themselves inside Castle Clinton. Lead the way. Our orders are to locate a barrel of ambrosia they are hiding inside. I will give you a schematic of the barrel, but first we will exterminate the NSF terrorists. Exterminate? A precious opportunity we cannot neglect. What about the rest of the ship? That is your brother's assignment. You will take the subway to meet him in Hill's kitchen. But first, we should deal with Castle Clinton. Are we going to the front, or is there another way? A secondary entrance would be useful, but I am aware of no such thing. Alright, good to know. Isn't that a... Isn't that a disturbing way of thinking things? Of, of seeing this as an opportunity to exterminate them. I mean, what is she, a fucking... Dalek? Hello. What are you? Yo, random kid, you got any useful information for me? I'm starving. Do you have anything to eat? How about some soy food? How about some soy food? Don't matter. I just need something in my stomach so I can fall asleep. Yeah, I know that feeling. Here you go. Do you have a place to stay? I sleep out on the dock where they unload the speedboats. Speedboats? Is that how the NSF get their supplies? I don't know. They're always coming in and out of the tunnel behind the soda machine. Interesting. I spy on them from the crates. The code is 9183. Clever boy. Thanks for the snack, mister. That's the least I can do. Ah. Oh. See? A little generosity can go a long fucking way, can't it? And this is why you take an interest in people. Let's see, lock right there. Let's check the surrounding area before I go in. Make sure I'm not missing anything. You know? Well, maybe you don't. Yo. Look at that. Don't have nobody at the side entrance. NSF can just walk away. Thanks for your sterling words about our military strategy. What did I mean now? Don't let me get in your way, officer. Don't worry, I won't. There's the main entrance, I see. Fools rush in, I suppose. Huh? And there they go, the fool. You were you just shooting? You're shooting your own guide, you idiot! Okay, never mind. I didn't find anything useful anyway, so I'm going to just head that off. Uh, did I? I think I already talked to him in the safe. That was good. All right then. Smart lock pick coming handy. And there we go. A single bit of soy food at the right time saves me an entire multi-tool. Looks like these tunnels head toward Castle Clinton. I can't find them on the map, though. Typical. 
Oh well, the map is not the territory after all. Anything in the water? I can't tell. That is some grimy fucking water. Probably because it's fucking water, I suppose. I'm not a big fan of the leaning mechanics in this game. They feel like a step down from beef. Turret. Okay. Okay. Struggle. I mean, the ones in beef weren't perfect. They were better. Come on, grab it. There we go. Let's be through there, okay. Interesting. Hi. Okay. Not that way. Unless, actually, I could pull that off if that other guy wasn't there. Shit. Someone there? Uh, that guy's still there. If I wait till that guy leaves entirely, I should be able to shoot behind that guy, take him out with the baton, and then get through wherever the fuck this is. I know I heard something. I got this one. No. Damn it. Who's even through here? Come on. Let me through. Let me through. Is there anything useful here? No, this just leaves back here. Damn it. Careful. Do you have a flamethrower? Oh, yes, okay. Good to know. Alright, so there's no point in going up there, aside from just if I wanted to just take everyone out on principle, but if I did, I'd go the other way. Just like I'm facing the other way. Or rather, he's not facing the other way. How did the camera see me from here? Gotcha. Now quickly. Hit. Uh I don't really care about the flame though, but I wanna move the guy's body. Flame breath. Nice. And now I have a flame thrower. Ho ho ho. Seems to take up exactly the same amount of space as the jet gun. Funny that. Shit. Shit. 
swear I heard something. Ooh. There we go. It never fails when it succeeds, and it always succeeds when it doesn't fail. What was that Clinton's safe key, I think it was? Hang on. Do I? Yeah, okay. Key of the Castle Clinton's safe. Sounds nice. Combat knife? Do I really care for the combat knife? Not particularly, but... It could come in handy. Somehow. I'm just gonna step- I'm just gonna take everything with me at this rate. Cigarettes? Sure, why not? I love this glitch. It makes the game so much more fun. And that's another thing that I will never forgive the modders for removing. It's so neat because it's not even like... It's not even like overpowered or anything per se. Because, I mean, it, or it's not like free inventory space because it does come at a cost. At the cost of making your inventory a lot harder to manage. Crap, you know? That's pretty cool. I actually, I once played a game which had that as like an intentional mechanic or something like that, where you had infinite inventory space, but the way the inventory was set up made it so that the more, the more stuff you had in your inventory. Come on, grab it. The, the harder and harder it became to actually manage that inventory. Or whatever. Is there anything up there, I wonder? Well, there's an easier way to tell. Wrong explosive. <laughs> Shit. Ah, fuck. I fell down the stairs. That's not enough. And this is an uh, this is another thing I love about this game. Uh, which, but one that I don't think any of the mods removed, and isn't really a glitch so much as a, well, exploit, I suppose. The whole thing of, like, climbing with mine, it's so neat. Nah. Nah, nothing up there. As I suspected. Oh, that's a fly. Well, that's where the ambrosia is, if I recall. But first, a word from our sponsors. Uh, locked. Or I could bust that. I could bust that down relatively easily with a gap gun or what have you. Be able to take it down? Yeah, whatever. Or just lock the hit. Let's see if I can find a key. Ooh. What is this? You're inside the kiosk of Castle uh -huh. Clinton. The bulk of the NSF troops must have gone through here to get underground. Alright. Here I am. Uh, do I have a key for this? No. That's kind of awkward. Did no one... Did no one down here have a key for, the, for those doors? That's inconvenient. I pro it was probably one of those people I didn't knock out that had it. How did I... Okay. I'm not sure how I got through there without the camera seeing me, but alright. That's 
Let's see what I can do about here then. What is that sentence? Let's see what I can do about here. What does that even mean? Perfect timing with that. Ooh. Perfect timing with that camera. God damn. Okay, no key on that body. Oh, I'm gonna have to waste the lockpick, aren't I? And I bet when I get out of there, I'm going to discover that- I'm going to immediately discover that someone on the outside has the key to that. Just to annoy me. Fuck it. I know I heard something. Damn it. Well, everyone's down, and I still don't have a key to that damn place. This is awkward. But hey, at least I'm limiting casualties. That's good. What if there's anything in here? You never know when there's something down in the water because the game developers were douchebags. Oh, who? What's this? Now, see, this is why you always level swimming. Oh. That leads us to here. Okay. That's not helpful. What? Who the fuck are you? I don't remember you being around. What? Where'd you come from? Over here, maybe? Wait a minute. I think I see- I think I might see. Wait. Yes! Here we go! Okay! The door was open for me! That... I mean, I guess that works. That guy apparently didn't even have the goddamn key on him. Which makes perfect sense. Hi. Wait, quiet! Don't mind me carrying a body along eh, right in front of you. It, it, it. Where did that dart go? I don't know. Oh, there. There really only two guys out here. Wait, quiet. I think there might only be two guys out here. Well, three. I guess there were three. <laughs> Before that guy went in, went down and saved my bacon. So yeah, I, I owe I owe quite a bit to that one random guy. Well, I owe. A lock, I suppose. That is not him. I mean, it might be to the AI, I don't know. Nice, nice. 
The auth door key. The auth what? Maybe it's to that door earlier. And this must be the safe or something. Yo. You a cop? Nah. You're not co-agent. How does a little boy get mixed up with the NSF? I just wanted to find some food, but they didn't have any. And then they started shooting at the police. Got some? You can have the soy food. You can have the soy food. You're cool. Glad I can help. Hey, I bet I can help you. Huh? Yeah. Soldiers have secret tunnels. They take boxes into the tunnel under the fort, but they never bring them back out. What kind of boxes? Steel. Big ones. Thanks. Maybe I'll check that out. I mean, not exactly very helpful at this point, but oh well. Nah, no, this doesn't work. Oh, there we go. Thanks, mister. That's the key to that. Alright. I wonder if it's. I wonder if it also goes to the other door, lower down. Probably not, but I might as well check. Nah. All right then. Time to use yet more of my. Well, or time to use a bit of this. Yeah. Now that I've cleared out everyone, for perhaps foolish reasons, that's where the damn key would be. Oh well. Commander Grimaldi, we liberated two canisters of this stuff, along with the Ambrosia, during the Liberty Island raid, but none of our people are quite sure what it is or what to do with it. Possibly a biological or chemical agent, but without the proper people and equipment, there's no way to tell. Lebedev suggested we keep one of the canisters and a barrel of ambrosia here at the contingency. The rest was shipped out to the airfield an hour ago. Alright. Aha! Augmentation canister. Aqualung and environmental resistance. Neither of which are actually really useful augments, to be frank. But oh well. Especially since I, since you should always upgrade swimming, and Aqualung is basically just a worse version of swimming. A swimming skill. Um, all right, let's do some hacking. Ice breaker. I'm sure ice is, is an acronym for something, but. No emails. All right. And what about you? because I don't have advanced computers. But doesn't really matter, frankly. I mean, it's certainly... Uh, advanced computers is certainly useful if you want to raise a bit of hell, but... Yeah. Anyways... I thought I was going to starve to death. I don't think I can use my... my... gap gun here. That'd be a bit gauche. The terrorists didn't even care. They thought I was lying. <laughs> Alright then, let's see what's in here. Wow, an entire bioelectric cell. My favorite. The terrorists didn't even care. Six, six, they thought six. I was lying. Alrighty then. Yeah, no. Oh. I sure hope I remember to save after disabling the cameras. Did I? Yes. Okay. Good. Yo. Objective complete. Agent Navarre will describe your next assignment and stay behind to protect the Ambrosia. Look for her out front. Alright.
Hello, boys. You are not afraid to kill. I am pleased. The last thing I would expect from the brother of Paul. I didn't kill anyone. Oh wait, right, of course. I for, uh, I forgot. There's a, some like ridiculous glitch here that leads to like that leads to it being extremely easy for you to w for it to wind up being like oh, oh wind up registering you as if you had killed slaughtered your way through the place despite not killing a single person, because which can be triggered by things as silly as like them killing a bunch of people or you non-lethally uh, taking someone out, but then picking up their body and dropping it. A lot of stupid stuff like that. It's real dumb. Oh well. I'm learning as I- <laughs> You mechs might have copper wiring to reroute your pure pain, but I've got nerves of steel. I I'm not gonna pick that one because you get one less EMP grenade from it. And... Nah, fuck it. You mechs might have copper wiring to reroute your fear of pain, but I've got nerves of steel. You are not a mech. You do not know what it is like. What's it like to stand around revving your actuators while the more advanced units complete the mission? Oh, no thanks. Nah. It was my error to believe that Yunatka super weapon would appreciate the chance to prove himself. Just give me the next objective. How dare I delay your search for glory? <laughs> the NSF in the subway station have taken hostages. Free them, but you know our standing orders. We do not make deals. Use this EMP grenade to disable the electronic detonators of the booby traps. Now we will see who is made of steel. I can take out a booby trap. You're a booby. Yeah. On the other hand, if I had chosen this... I'm learning as I go. You just passed lesson one. Lesson two is how we deal with the terrorists in the subway station. I'm ready. The terrorists have wired the platform with explosives and put in hostages. Get the hostages out if you can, but make sure the NSF learned that human shields will not work against you, Natko. Nothing we can't handle with a few EMP grenades. We are thinking the same thought. I will equip you with two grenades. They will disable any electronic detonators within a radius of 20 meters. <laughs> so you see. By, n by not being an asshole for no reason, we get twice the EMP grenades. Uh. Which, I mean, I... Not necessarily gonna need a, bunch, a lot of EMP grenades, but hey, all the more things to use as stepping stones. Hang on. What? Why are you two wielding knives? Why don't- you should have guns! Good work. What are you doing? You're gonna go in and fucking stab them. No wonder you were running in like idiots while she was shooting you in the back. I don't blame her for shooting you. Shield. Alrighty then. How long have I been recording? Eh, only like half an hour. I've got time. Let's go deal with some terrorists. Our country tis the sweet land of liberty of the icing. Don't that just say it all. Oh. Got five credits for someone who's got the great death? Sure. Here you go. God bless you. <laughs> That's the end of that interaction. Ow. I don't think you benefit at all from that. It's just a nice thing to do. Ah, crap. Okay. Let's deal with some terrorists, shall we? Quite a few. Okay. Let me just do a bit of climbing real quick because nobody ever looks up. Not in this, I don't mean in this game, I mean just in general in life.
you want to stay out of sight, I recommend getting high. Or, failing that, get low. It should be so pretty obvious that... Oh. Staying... Being out of their... Okay, I guess things are kicking off anyways. Ah! What? Come on! How... Bloody hell. I really wish I could just sneak in here without these guys setting them all off. What? Did you just shoot at me? No! Could you not run in and... and start shooting and spoil my whole stealth thing for five minutes? Oh, God fucking damn it. Do you realize... They're just running in with knives. Well, these guys have guns and hostages. What are you doing? Idiot. Oh, ah. Christ, this is just, I mean... Fuck, why do I even bother with stealth? They're just gonna immediately spoil it. No good reason. What is even the trigger for that, anyways? guys doing? Why are you running towards me? Idiots. All of you idiots. And unfortunately this the stealth in Deus Ex works kind of like stealth in Thief where if it's broke, where if they get into combat with anyone, suddenly, they act as if they were in combat with you. <sighs> well, I think they won. God damn. I was gonna go in, sneakily deal with them, come out stealthily and non lethally but you guys have to... Actually, it wasn't even the- I don't even think it was the Unaco Trooper. I think the fucking NSF guys are just lunatics. They decided to just charge the barricade for no reason. Maybe not for no reason. Maybe because they realized, hang on, these guys are just armed with knives and we're armed with guns. And so we should... And so we should, uh, run directly up to them so they can stab us with their knives. Whatever. I'm sure it makes sense in their head. And now they're all dead. They think they're all dead. Well, all the ones up here, anyway. They're still the ones down there. Ooh. What is this? everyone go? Did they kill each other? Okay. Okay then, is anything here worth a lockpick? Oh, a lockpick. 
that's worth it. I guess. Where's, where was the other one again? I forget. Yeah, here. Quad charger, no. Quad, a useful thing, but. I'll get plenty. I'll probably run out of space for the ammo before I start dealing with enemies that actually really need it. Okay. I'll come back to that lockpick if I don't find a key to that, which I probably won't. Well then, let's start exploring the vents. Come to Battery Park, we'll get together, have a few laughs. What the heck is this? The NSF terrorists in the subway have threatened to blow up the platform. Watch for booby traps. You're a booby trap. the bozos. How many terrorists? One, two, three, four, four. No, five. This could be a problem. Four. Maybe. Actually. What a weird thing for him to do. Who's there? Take them off us. I could just hit them all with pink laser darts and run away into the, into the vent. That could probably work. Who was that? I didn't see a uniform. Or I could just hit. Uh, or maybe I could just throw a grass I grenade into the good. when they're all clustered together and then hit them with a baton. Or, or. Or that guy being there is a bit awkward, but I can work with it. Hey, hostages, sir. Who are you? I'm a UNATCO agent. As soon as I open the train, okay. Hey, hey I got okay. This. Gonna have to skip to that dialogue, of course. But if I can pull this off, it'll be kind of dumb. <sighs> But it could work, sir. What do I what? do? I'm with you. Damn it! Ah! Ah! Yeah. Uh, okay. I'll have to time this right so that nobody's looking this way for a while. Will I see the body? Maybe not. Did it work? I think so. Watch out! There we go. A lot more finicky than I expected, but will be all right. now take the train to Hell's Kitchen and it worked. To your and all it cost me was a single trink dart. Okay, now I just need to sneak back 
pick that lock. Oh, there was a vent right there. Yeah, whatever. Ah, here we go. Where the fuck is this? I have no memory of this place. Oh. Right, I think I checked that, but it didn't, it didn't seem to open. But I guess I needed to open it from below? Whatever. Was it this one or the other one? I forget. It was the other one. Although I guess... Actually, now that I think about it... Yeah. Hang on. Yeah, I can just bust it open. Assuming there's no one here that would hear that. Anyone hear that? It's a good thing these lo these lock picks and shit are made of sterner stuff than the things that they're in. Ow. Hi. I wonder what's in those chests behind them. Well, that was a horrible shot. Let me just quickly look. Huh, a lockpick. Well, it's not worth the hassle. Let's just go. I mean, this lockpick was barely worth the hassle. Thank goodness for grenades. Grenades and hands. I mean, not grenades, rockets. Well, I guess... I get. Are these rocket-propelled grenades, or are they just... Or are they just rockets? I don't know. Although, I don't... Although, actually, come to think of it, I think rocket-propelled grenade might actually be a retronym. And the original or acronym for... The original thing that RPG meant was something else. I, but I don't recall... And there we go. Not a single NSF trooper killed or it spotted me. And all it cost was a single trank dog. Hey, hey. Huh? Oh. Whoops. Yeah, whatever. Ooh. Got a bit dicey there for a bit, especially with that guy taking doing something very bizarre. I mean, I've... I've seen people- uh, I knew that, that destroying that crate would have alerted someone, but what a really bizarre path to take. It was like he was specifically trying to be, put himself in a place that would be maximally inconvenient to me. Real, really weird. And then he just st st stayed there for no reason. I, I've done that sort of thing a million times before in previous playthroughs, and that's never happened. Although it is all, uh, although if I recall, it is always that guy with the planes over that comes over. But he all, but he almost always takes another, uh, like the opposite pathway, and then just leaves. I don't know. It's just pure, purely being. It's just purely there to annoy me, I suppose. But oh well. Regardless, we we got we went in. Rescued the hostages, got out, and it was like we were never there. <sighs> Good times. And now we're in... What is it? Hell's Kitchen. Naturally. Yeah. But I'll leave Hell's Kitchen to next episode, and probably the next, and the next, because Hell's Kitchen is a big-ass sprawling area that it's, it's easy to get lost in. But hey, at least it's not as bad as the, as the revision Hell's Kitchen. Ugh. And that's not even the worst of revisions uh, maps. Oh well. So until, so, until then, I have been Joe Bob. And I'm very peed. And remember, 
dislike the video, unsubscribe if you're for some reason subscribed, and leave a nasty comment in the comment section down below. Fuck you all so much for watching, and so long, suckers.